Hi, welcome to Movies Incident English. Today I am going to tell you about an Indian thriller film named Anda Doon. This story is about a man whose name is Akash who works as a blind man but he can see everything. He goes to the actor's house to play the piano, but he sees that the actor has been murdered by his wife and his wife's lover. He goes to the police station to report the murder, but comes to know that the inspector is the lover of the actor's wife. The wife and lover understand that Akash is not a blind person, so will the wife and lover kill Akash? Will Akash tell the police about the murder? To know everything, watch this video till the end. If you want to see the explanation of this movie with real characters and a real background, then click on the description link. Or, if you want to see the explanation of this movie with 3D characters and a funny background, then watch this video till the end. We see one blind man playing the piano. His name is Akash. Akash is not a blind person, but he acts as a blind person so that he can concentrate on musical work. In the next scene, we see a person named Pramid Sinha, who works in the film industry. His second wife's name is Simi, and she is much younger than him. Akash meets a girl on the road. Her name is Sophie, who takes him to her dad's restaurant to play the piano and drops Akash at his home. Akash sees Sophie while she leaves home. One little boy sees Akash, that he is watching Sophie and understands that Akash is not blind. The next day Sophie comes to pick up Akash at his house and both of them go to a restaurant. Akash plays piano in the restaurant and Pramod Sinha also comes to that restaurant. Sinha likes Akash's music. Pramod Sinha invites Akash to his house to play the piano and also gives him some advance money. Pramod Sinha and Simi are shown talking to each other. Tomorrow is the anniversary of both but Sinha is going to Bangalore tomorrow. Sophie comes to Akash's house to find him, and both of them get wet due to the rain. Akash and Sophie drink alcohol together, and later they get physical by kissing each other. The next morning Akash goes to Pramod Sinha's house to play the piano. Simi opens the door and says that Pramod is not at home. Akash says that he has been invited by Pramod to play the piano because of the anniversary. Simi does not want Akash to come home, but when an old woman comes out of her flat, then Simi allows Akash to enter in her flat. Simi makes Akash sit and play the piano, and confirms that Akash cannot see at all by asking him questions. Akash starts playing the piano, and Simi starts listening to the piano, but then Akash sees something and gets shocked. Akash sees a man lying on the floor. Akash asks Simi to use the bathroom, and Simi takes him to the bathroom, then Akash sees Pramod Sinha lying on the floor. Akash sees Simi's boyfriend in the bathroom. Akash discovers that Pramod has been shooted by a gun, and starts playing the piano again, and the scene goes past. Pramod Sinha opens the door of his house and comes inside. Pramod brings Vine's bottle and flowers and searches for Simi in the house. Pramod hears Simi's voice coming from the bedroom and sees the gun lying on the table. Pramod takes the gun in his hand, and Simi comes from the bedroom. Pramod says surprise to Simi, but he is surprised because Simi was not alone in the bedroom, she also had a lover named Manoar. Vine and flowers fall from Pramod's hand. The scene comes in the present. Manoar comes out of the bathroom. Manoar and Simi are convinced that Akash cannot see, and they both try to dispose of Pramod's dead body, but Akash sees them. Simi rings the house bell with Manoar, and acts that Pramod has come back home, and plays Pramod's voice from the speaker. Simi makes feel Akash that Pramod is just coming into the house. Akash also says thank you Pramod sir. Akash is now acting as the blind person in front of both of them. If Simi and Manoar come to know that Akash is not a blind person, then both of them will kill Akash. Manoar keeps Pramod's dead body in a bag, and Simi pretends that Pramod is leaving the house now. Simi tells Akash to leave the house now. In the next scene, Akash talks to one lottery seller, and the lottery seller requests the rickshaw driver to drop Akash. Akash goes straight to the police station. Akash tells the policeman that he wants to report a murder. Manoar was also present in front of Akash. Akash discovers that Sinha's wife's lover is a policeman. Akash changes his topic and says that his cat has been murdered. Manoar takes Akash to Akash's house. Manoar wants to confirm once again that Akash is completely blind. After some time Manoar walks out of Akash's house, Simi comes to Sophie's dad's restaurant, and there is Akash who is still playing the piano. 
Now the news comes in the media that Pramod Sinha has been shot dead. Pramod Sinha's daughter comes to the police station. Manohar tries to frame the one man in Pramod Sinha's murder. Akash talks to Pramod's daughter Donnie and gives his false statement to the police that he talked to Pramod on that day. Simi tells everyone Fall's story about Pramod Sinha. She says that Pramod came later that day, but his neighbor informed the police that on murder day, the third man also came, and he came before Pramod. Simi learns that her neighbor is giving her a statement about Pramod's murder, then Simi takes her out of her house and throws her from the gallery. Akash has also come out of the lift at the same time. Akash sees that Simi has pushed the old lady down, but he again acts as a blind person. Akash comes to his house and the little boy finds out that Akash is not blind. He records a video of Akash from the window to tell everyone that Akash is not blind. Simi comes to Akash's house and gives one sweet to Akash. Simi wanted to confirm that Akash is blind. She puts something in front of Akash in Akash's coffee and tells Akash to drink coffee, but Akash does not drink coffee. He spills the coffee. Then Simi takes out one gun and puts it up. Akash puts both his hands up and tells that he is not blind. Simi now knows that Akash is not blind, and Akash has seen both murders. Akash tells Simi that he will not tell anyone about two murders. After some time Akash falls and finds out that something added to the sweets. He is dizzy. Akash faints and falls. Sophie comes to Akash's house and the little boy shows Sophie one video of Akash. After seeing the video, Sophie understands that Akash is not blind. Sophie comes inside Akash's house and sees Simi without clothes. Akash is lying unconscious on the bed, and Sophie thinks Akash and Simi are having an affair. Sophie tells Simi that Akash is not blind, and leaves. Akash regains consciousness and cannot see anything. Akash comes to know that he has been made blind for real by Simi. Simi goes away after deleting the video of the boy. Akash calls Sophie but she does not speak to him. Manoar tells Simi that she should have killed Akash instead of making him blind. Manoar goes to Akash's house to kill Akash, but Akash runs away from home. Now being blind, he cannot see anything, and he falls into a collision with one pillar. Akash regains consciousness. He comes to know that the lottery seller and rickshaw driver have brought him to one old house. There is only one doctor. The rickshaw driver, lottery seller, and doctor have made up their mind that, that both kidneys of Akash will sell, and they will distribute money. Akash comes to know that the doctor is going to do something bad with the operation. That's why he attracts the lottery seller and the rickshaw driver with one crore and is telling their profile. Due to the greed of one crore, all three of them cancel Akash's operation. After some time, Akash regains consciousness and tells them his story. Now all four of them make plans to blackmail Simi and Manoar to get the money. Simi sees Akash and Pramod's daughter after coming home. Simi goes out with Akash, then Akash asks Simi for 10 lakh rupees, and if he does not get 10 lakhs, he will tell everyone about Simi, but Simi says no to Akash. Lottery seller and rickshaw driver kidnap Simi. Akash calls Manoar's wife and tells her that her husband is having an affair with Pramod Sinha's wife, and her husband has killed Pramod Sinha for one crore, and asks her for one crore, and if he does not get money, then he will tell the media about it. Manoar's wife gets infatuated with Manoar. The news comes in the media that Simi has committed suicide, Sophie thinks that Simi has eloped with Akash. There is a doctor who takes Simi's blood sample to transplant Simi's cornea to Akash, then Simi says that we did not kill Pramod. Pramod saw Manoar and her together, in the same gun lying there, then Pramod died in the accident. Simi's entire talk is recorded on the phone, and they demand one crore from her. Now all four of them blackmail Simi. The rickshaw driver and lottery seller tie Akash with ropes so that he will not run away. Both the rickshaw driver and the lottery seller go to collect money from Manoar. Simi and Akash both try to release themselves from the rope. The doctor gets the report of Simi's blood sample. Manoar takes the bag and goes to the rickshaw driver and lottery seller. Manoar shoots the rickshaw driver but steps into the lift himself. The rickshaw driver is taken to the hospital by the lottery seller. Simi and Akash both untie their ropes and fight with each other then the doctor comes. Simi fight with the doctor, then Akash makes Simi unconscious. The doctor tells the lottery seller that the rickshaw driver is dead. 
The lottery seller finds out that she has fake notes in the bag. Akash and the doctor know that the rickshaw driver is dead. The doctor plans to go out of India with Akash and Simi in the trunk of the car so that Simi's liver can be given to Sheikh's daughter, and in return Sheikh will give him $1 million. Now the scene of the film has gone to the future after two years in Europe, Sophie is shown there. Sophie sees that Akash is singing a song with black glasses on. Sophie joins Akash and the two sit down at the coffee shop. Now Akash narrates the further story to Sophie, when Doctor was going in the car with Akash and Simi, and the scene goes to the past. Simi regains consciousness in the trunk of the car. The doctor goes to give her an injection of unconsciousness, but Simi killed the doctor and starts driving the car. Akash discovers that Simi has come in the car instead of the doctor. Simi asks Akash to get out of the car, and Akash goes out of the car. Akash stands on the road. Simi makes long U-turn with the car. She wanted to hit Akash with her car, and on the same road, one man was about to kill the rabbit with his gun. He aims his gun at the rabbit and shoots a gun, but the rabbit comes into the glass of Simi's car by digging. Simi is about to hit Akash with her car, but due to rabbits coming in front of her, her car meets with an accident, and the car gets burnt, and Simi dies. Now the scene comes back to Akash and Sophie in Europe. Sophie says you should have taken Simi's cornea, but Akash walks away without saying anything. Akash walks on the road wearing dark glasses, and a stick in his hand, and throws the cold drink lying on the road to the side by hitting it with his stick. It means Akash can see everything now, and he is not blind, and the movie ends. If you want to see the explanation of this movie with real characters and real background, then click on the description link. Hope you enjoy this movie explanation. See you again in the next video.